to day three of trying to uh, work a little bit every day on the uh, wheel horse 800 special today's goals are last time we got the uh, uh, center console off for lack of a better term today we're gonna get the mounting bracket off for the um, mower deck we're gonna get these bolts off from where the engine was mounted and then we are going to get this back bolt off for the uh, hitch at which point we should be good to really start wire wheeling this so that those are the goals for today Let's see how far we can get on this So far, this has been pretty simple to work on. Everything has either been half inch or 9 16 bolts. Going into the weekend, I would like to uh, maybe find some time. Um, maybe Sunday afternoon if I can make it work to maybe do a live. And uh, spend some time working on this. It's been a long time since I did some wrenching and did a live. I think that would be pretty neat. Um, so far I've been surprised at the simplicity of this as it's stripped down to um, all the parts and pieces and components on this just you know how, how cool it is when it's together but also just how really simple it is how it how it fits together in the different parts and pieces well that was easy enough What are you doing, Muffin? What are you finding, girl? All right. So here's that center piece, side piece, which as we strip more and more of these off, all this stuff is just gonna end up in the ultrasonic cleaner. That, that seems to be the meal ticket to me, uh, the easiest way to Get it stuff clean. We got dog. Oh. Don't eat that. It's part of luck. Hey! Don't eat that. for you guys that I'm kind of debating about. Do I leave the uh, Briggs and Stratton engine cover black or do I take it off and attempt to powder coat it red to match the rest of the tractor? Um, just, just something that I've been toying with. There's that. Well, what are you doing? What do you got over there? Huh? 
What do you got over there, girl? All right, next we're gonna take these out. Hey, look at that. Once again, 9 16 bolts. I'm really liking these swivel sockets or uh, ratchets. If you guys get a chance to grab some, they are come highly, highly recommended. Uh, I think I've got these ones two years ago after watching a whole bunch of Olsa tool ads. And uh, I got them at Christmas time, so I got a pretty good deal on them. We got a leaf muffin. Come on, you stinker. There you go. A little too much grease in there. All right, got that out. Pretty much the only thing left to do now is we're gonna remove this back piece for the hitch. See, I got you guys position. Lucky As you can see, there is nothing left but the frame now. Uh, plans going forward. Hopefully tomorrow we'll get this thing outside. I got a little wagon that I'm going to set it on. It's not, not too bad now that it's all stripped down, but um, I'm going to put it on the wagon. Get the pressure washer out. We're going to pressure wash this then get it back in here and... Um, start taking the wire wheel to it from there i think it should hang in my usual uh painting stand 
Um, anybody that's interested in something like that on the cheap, what I ended up doing was uh, um, I got a uh, I got a uh, a cheapo. Um, it's like a coat rack, and that's what we end up using. So, um, thanks for watching. See you in the next one.